Hello, hello. How are you today? How are you, teacher? Hello, good to see you and hear you again. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? Fine, and you? I'm pretty Fine, good. Teacher. I'm pretty good. Thank you for asking. Everything is good. And what about you? Likewise. Likewise. Okay, likewise. likewise. Likewise is igualmente, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Excellent. How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? Good. Good. Very good. Los, Tú. los escucho así como algo, así como algo apagaditos. What happened? What happened? Último día de clases, teacher. Vaya, mañana descansan. Y ustedes que saben si les doy el 4, así que tranquilos, por eso no se preocupen. Ustedes pónganse felices, aprovechen. Último día. No. Siempre las cambian, teacher. ¿Mande? No nos den mentiras, teacher. No nos emocionen. <risa> no nos emocionen mucho. Siempre las cambian. Siempre nos cambian. Sí, siempre las cambian. Sí. Ok. Ya, yeah, I know. Yo sé que siempre nos cambian, pero es bueno para ustedes, para que vean nuevas metodologías y eh, si se acostumbren a diferentes pronunciaciones. That's why yes, that, is, that is very good for you, that you are going to learn every single time. So you have to learn every single day, every single time. Any, any question that you are going to have in the future, please let me know. I will try to help you, okay? So don't worry about it, okay? Okay, but tell me, how was it? You are so tired, a little bit tired. What did you do today? What did you do today? Uh-huh, Jorge, what did you do today? Mm, what did you do? Uh -huh. mm. uh, work, teacher. Work, just work. In the morning, I work. Ah, okay. I you work uh, in the morning. What else? In the morning, work. Okay, you work. In the afternoon. Uh huh. I, I, I was supermarket. Ah, you went. Oh, I was in the supermarket. Okay, I was. Okay, what else? Uh huh. Mm. ¿Qué más hizo? Cuénteme. Solo trabajar, ir al, al supermercado y después a la casa. Después a la, después a la clase, teacher. Ah, y después, de, después que llegó a su casa, a la clase. A la clase. Ok, that's great. Ok, so what we're going to do right now. So we're going to start with the class. Yes, so we're going to start with the class. Today is the last class of the module number three right okay hello rosember rosember right hello teacher rosember rosember ay señor de los cielos mis 16 días no, no, han ya, no, ya le sale un poquito mejor ya me sale un poquito mejor. Los 16 días fracasé. <laughs> okay. Thank Sorry. you everybody to be here on time. Remember today is the last class. So um, we're going to have a little bit fun today because we're going to have the review about the last yesterday class. And also you, if you have any question about any of these topics that we were 
um, practice doing this module, okay? So if you have any questions, please let me know. And that's it, right? Today is Wednesday, April 20. Uh-huh. 20? Eighth. 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 Okay, eighth. 2021. Okay, so today we're mm -hmm. going to just the review about the yesterday class and also today we're going to practice their reading about Ricky Martin, I guess. That is the last reading that we have in the book. Yeah, I guess. And also, if you have any question about the yesterday grammar, so we can cover. Okay, so the agenda for today is um, the gradients, the review, the topic reading activity. Now we're going to practice the topic and congratulations, you did it. So I would eliminate this because uh, you finish all the exercise and the platform. So yeah. congratulations. And thank you so much for that. Okay, so the objective or the general objective that we're going to discuss and today is going to be about the students will be able to learn and practice the reading skill. What is that means? That we're going to do just a little reading about, I guess, is Ricky Martin. Yep. Uh -huh. The information about him. So that was my short presentation. So now you're going to tell me what do you remember about yesterday class? Uh huh. Tell me. What do you remember about it? Vimos cómo usar el was, were y el din. El did, okay. Tell me. Hicieron la tarea. Hoy no recibí ningún WhatsApp teacher. Ah, como no, estoy de mentirosa. Recibí uno. Uno creo que recibí. Este... No dejó tarea, teacher. Oh, me, va no dejó, un, teacher. me va a dar un paro cardíaco I ahorita. Remember, I don't remember, dice. ¿Se recuerdan que le mostré esta? Y yo le dije. Oh, yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. Ah, yes, teacher. Ah, ya vieron. Ya vieron que Hoy sí. Hoy sí, ya recordamos. <ríe> ok, that was the homework. Ok, y alguien me preguntó de la tarea y me puse a hacer algo más. Perdón, este, no le dije cuál era la tarea. Así que esa persona no está fui, perdida. Que no recordé. Quiero ver si es cierto, si es usted. Si es usted, está perdonado. Veamos. Yo le fui, yo fui. En serio. 75108901. Ah, es cierto. Es cierto. Va, perdonado. <ríe> Perdón, está perdonado. <ríe> ok. No, pero recordé, teacher, yo la hice, pero no sé si está bien. Ok. So, we're going to. Right, donde dice. Ajá. Uh -huh. like... uh -huh. Donde dice, si quieres, se la voy diciendo así en orden. Ok, veamos. Vamos a ir, espéreme, espéreme, antes que se, espéreme, si está bueno. espéreme, antes que se emocione, no voy a ser yo quien lo califique, ok, va a ser alguien All más, right. va a ser sus compañeros, ok, ok, so we're going to start, Jorge, you're going to say your answers and someone else is going to help you that is going to be correct or incorrect that you are going to check it or not, okay? You're, you're going to write a check that you're going to be correct or incorrect, okay? Okay. Okay, number one. Uh, my friend did at the shopping more two days ago. Uh -huh, what do you think? Carla. Hola. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, está buena. Ajá, uh -huh. está buena. Porque 
Sí, porque después sigue el, el verbo. At the shopping. Ajá. So, shopping. ¿Cómo dijo Jorge? Did. My friend did. did. At the shopping. Did. Are you sure? My friend did. At the shopping. Are you sure? Está el verbo con ing. Sería what? Mm, no. No. Porque después de was, este, no, no puede ir ningún verbo. Por lo menos así que hemos estado aprendiendo. Ajá. Pero el verbo parece progresivo ahí. No sé si me equivoco. Sí, puede ir del was. Solo que va en. en... Va en, hay en progresivo. Shop, do you think that is shopping mall es un verbo? Shopping mall es. Uh, no, porque llevaría, lleva el at that, entonces tiene que ser un locativo. Uh -huh. What do you think? Sería guas. Yo coincido que sea guas. No sé. Are you sure? Friend. Sería friend. Porque friend. es my friend. Son, ah. son ellos. Sí. Yes, right. Pero para ellos que no sería where. Sí. Por, el, por yeah. eso, where. Sería yeah. my friend uh, where. My friends friend where. where. Yes. My friend where at the shopping mall two days ago. Shopping mall no es... Eh, En este caso no estamos ocupando como de ir a comprar o de compras, sino que estamos hablando del lugar, shopping mall. Lugar. Ah. Entonces, este no es que sea un verbo con ing. Pero... Sino que estamos hablando del lugar, de donde va a ser Ajá. shopping mall. Ajá. La diferencia lo haría el at en este caso. El at de es como está, estuvieron mis amigos estuvieron en el mall, eh, en el centro comercial dos días atrás. O, oh, ajá, dos días atrás. El centro de compras o algo así. Ajá. Eso. Entonces, ¿cómo, ¿cómo hago la diferencia cuando ponen el shopping como lugar y como verbo? Aquí, como dice shopping mall, me está hablando de lugar. Entonces, si usted dijera aquí es palabra compuesta. Ajá, es una palabra compuesta. Compound noun. Compound noun. Oh, yes. right. En este caso no es el verbo. Yes. Mm, okay. I was shopping uh, with my friends my new dress. Yes. Estuve comprando mi vestido con mis amigos. Ok, number two. Leonardo and I. No, Leonardo and I, where? 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 Correct. Where? Correct. Where? Correct. Where? 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 right? Because we have where? the where? negation over here. Where? Ah, pues sería where? 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 Ok, 13. What? Was, was okay. Was from, good. Was Saori at home when you come back from work? Okay. Number fourteen. Where they were? Huh? Was they didn't tell was. where? Where? Uh -huh. wow. Where? They, where? where? Yes. Remember that when we're going to use they, you, and we, we're going to use where. 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 Okay. where. Excellent. Fifteen. How to? Okay, Adam. Was. Was really warm and dry this year. Okay. When. I did. When? Um, what? A child. Uh, was. 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 When? A child. 
was, he was. Uh -huh. Okay. 17. Uh-huh. 10. 10. 17. the 17 that was was where or what and this one wasn't 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 why was it? Ah. Okay, because you're talking about the movie. Okay. The movie it. Uh -huh. it. Okay. Yes, of course. Then eighteen. Eighteen. My daughter was. Where? No, my daughter where? where? Okay, where? good. Uh, nineteen. She was. Was. At all wasn't. Ah, okay, wasn't right. So because we have here. Her house. Okay, yeah. and the last one? 20, last one. 20, what square? Was. Uh -huh. uh huh, the last one? What? 20, what square? What? Your biggest success what? as professional. Sorry, repeat it again. Uh, Jose what? Ismael. What was? Ah, okay. Thank you, everybody. That was good. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, thank you. Okay, that was easy. Medium. Medium. Why medium? La, la once y, y en la diecisiete me quedé un poco confundida. Ah, en esta porque está hablando de amigos y no está Ajá. hablando del verbo este, de ir a comprar algo, porque el verbo oh. es shop, shop, Ajá. ing, yes. O sea, yo estaba, es que aparentemente como hay palabras compuestas que no las conozco, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces, a, al, yo no lo había unido a las dos palabras, solamente shopping. Ah. Entonces... Ahí es donde yo me confundí, pero ya con la explicación estoy un poquito, con un poquito más, más de práctica. Vamos a poder seguir. Excellent. Okay, so in the 17, there. Okay, estamos hablando de la película. Es como que estuviera aquí. It. There it. Yes, there isn't. Okay, or in this case, there wasn't. Porque está hablando de la movie. O sea, como que diga en español, no había ninguna película este, buena en la tele, algo así. Yes. No sé si me ya, comprende. Ya, claro. Sí, ya. Ok. Es que es esa palabra que, que, que no está después de there, es la que me confundí un poquito. Mm -hmm. El it. Yes. Pero oh. ya, ya con lo que acabé de explicar ya me quedó claro. Ok, excellent. Ok, so I don't know if you. Uh, sí, have... ya, la veinte yes. está buena. ¿Cómo me dijo usted? Max, where? What was? ¿Por qué where? Porque como pensé que el your es you. Tú, no. El your es, está hablando de usted, pero como que yo le esté, espéreme, espéreme, como que usted le, me esté preguntando, espéreme, what was your, está hablando de algo más que usted hizo, 
que cuál fue su mayor satisfacción profesional. Entonces, está hablando de usted, pero de algo que usted hizo, de como una tercera cosa. No sé si me explico qué es suyo, pero le está preguntando de algo que es suyo, como que le dijera, eh, what was your favorite color when you was a child? Por ejemplo, ¿cuál era el, su color favorito cuando estaba pequeño o niño? O que le preguntara, ¿cuál es su mayor logro a nivel educación? Ajá. Eso significa mm. en su vida profesional. Uh -huh. mm. Es algo suyo, pero no está hablando de su persona, sino que algo que usted hizo. Ay, qué complicado. No. <ríe> no sé si me entiende. Sí, pero ya, más o menos ahí. Es así como que, yeah, diga, ¿cuál es su mayor, cuál es su mayor este, satisfacción profesional que ha tenido a la fecha en español? ¿Ya? Uh -huh. En inglés el your eh, no está hablando de usted, de you. Sino que de uh, suyo. Yo lo había respondido con el you, yo. No, es your, es de suyo. Ok. Ah, de suyo. Uh -huh. Ok. Clear. Yes. Ok. Yes, so... Uh, before we continue with the new topic or the things that we are going to develop, and I hope you did, I don't know if you did this part, this part, I don't know if you complete all those square. No sé si sí. completaron, completaron, <laughs> completaron, perdón. Okay, so I will stop to share right now my short, my short presentation. And I will pass the first time the attendance, okay? So, okay, just give me a second. Okay, so we're going to start with, wait a second. Ay, señor. Regálenme un, un segundito. Okay, eh, Adriana Guadalupe. Adriana. Present teacher. Thank you. Jesus Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jocelyn Graciela. Jorge Alexis. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ismael. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Jocelyn Madaí. Jocelyn Madaí. <laughs> Juan Carlos Menéndez. Present teacher. Thank you. Juan Fernando. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Maricela. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Paola. Carla Paola. Ok. Uh, Catherine Abigail. Present. Thank you. Catherine Giselle. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenya Jamilet. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Kenny Jamilet. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Liborio Adiel. Uh, Lorena Jamilet. Lorena Jamilet. Mario Adolfo. Okay. Maybelline Dariana. Present. Lorena. Lorena, are you here? Yes. Okay, thank you, Lorena. Miguel Alexander. Miguel Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Miguel Ángel Guardado. Present. Thank you. Natalia Inés. Present. Thank you, Nelson Javier. Present. Thank you, Norma Enriquez. Present teacher. Thank you, Oscar Salvador. Present teacher. Thank you, Raquel Beatriz. Present. Thank you, Rodolfo López. Present. 
Thank you. Rosenberg, Armando. Rosenberg. Ay, fallé. Rosenberg. Me castigo. Ay, thank you. Rosemary, Janet. Um, Roxana, Melissa. Present, teacher. Thank you. Stephanie, Lisette. Present. Thank you, everybody. That was the first time that I uh, passed attendance. So good. Okay. So just give me a second. Okay. Give me a second. Okay. I will um, do it something right now. Just give me a second. Okay. 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 So I will share right now my short presentation that is going to be here. Okay. So now what we're going to do? Everybody did this activity. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we have school days. Yes. Complete the warm up with words from the list. Then listen and check. Okay, who wants to read it? Miguel Angel, please read it. Okay. Desde el inicio. Yes, classroom. Classroom. College. college 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 elementary elementary uh -huh. continue gym yes i uh -huh. history yes uh, junior high okay lunch room okay math Math. Physical education. Okay. Playground. Mm -hmm. Science. 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 Okay. Thank you. Okay. So we have three different squares over there. So we have classes, schools, and places. Okay. So in classes, which one do you think that we are going to write over there? History. Ah, okay. History is one. Math. Okay. Uh, just give me a second. I will do something right now. Okay. Okay. Math. Science. And Science. physical. Education. Education. Science. Thank you. Okay, yes. Okay, so, uy, teacher. Okay, so now we have uh, classes, right? So now it's schools. College. College. Okay, just give me a sec. Okay, give me a sec. Okay, college, another one. Elemental. Okay. Elementary. Elementary. High. 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 Junior high. Junior high. Junior high. Junior high. Where is it? It's over here. Okay. And places. Gym. Gym. Okay. Just give me a second. <laughs> Playroom. Okay. Playground. Okay, that is going to be. Just give me a second. Please, please, please. Okay, Jim. The other one? Lunch room. Uh, playground. Playground. And. Lunch room. And the junior. Okay, finish. Lunch room. Ay, que desorden, teacher. Yo lo hice más bonito. 
<laughs> ok, veamos cómo se ve. Ok, so we have college, elementary, eh, high, junior high, that is going to be for schools, right? Cool. For classes, we have um, um, history, history, math, math physical, science. educational, and science. Okay, good. <laughs> Uh, and for the last one, places. We have classrooms, we have gym, we have lunchroom, and playground. Okay? Ya vieron que sí entendí mi disorder. Okay, excellent. Easy. Okay, so now what we are going to do right now? Find out about find out about your partner's elementary, junior high, or high school days, ask this question, then tell the class. Okay, Adriana, we're going to start with her. So you are going to ask any of this question to anybody. Okay. Va a utilizar cualquiera de estas preguntas a cualquiera de sus compañeros. Que, que no alcanza a ver, solo hago más grande. Ya aquí tengo en mi en la computadora, gracias, ah, teacher. Perfecto. Que sí, porque no, esa letrita no la alcanzo a ver. Ni ahorita. Tampoco. Eh, Veamos. Sí. Hacer. Hoy sí. ¿Y ahora? Sí. Quiero ver a Carla. What was is your favorite class? Why? Oui. Why? Mm, why? Uh, my favorite class is English. Was. Mm. My favorite class was English, was English. because I, mm, I, no, I see. Yeah. Mm, no sé, me encanta. Because I love Aunque it. No lo puedo mucho. Okay, because I love it and I will learn it. Because I, lo I love it. Uh -huh. ¿En qué me dijo? And I will learn it. In, I will learn. learn. Uh -huh, and I will I'm learn. Good. Okay, good. Okay. Thank you, uh, Carla. Now you're going to ask any of this question to anybody. Um, maybe. What was your last favorite class? We. Oui. Why? Why? What was your Lab list? Paper class. ¿Cómo? List. List. Paper class. Why? Why? Um, Teacher. Sí. ¿Qué es list? Sí. ¿Ah? ¿Qué menos le gusta? Menos te gusta. ¿Qué menos te gusta? Menos. ¿Qué menos le gusta? Mm. <risa> 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 Más. <risa> English. <risa> no, no, no sé. <risa> Oh, el ejemplo de inglés más <laughs> teacher matemático te pongo un ejemplo más diga English science Ma science <laughs> ok why because it's bored. Oh, <laughs> okay. Maybe <laughs> another question to anybody. Okay. 
Uh, Jorge Alexis. Present. Who was your best friend? Va. Está siendo grabado. <laughs> mm. For moment, nothing. No one. No tiene mejor amigo. Mm, no. Oh, okay. Okay. Good. So now, Jorge Alexis, ask the last question to anybody. Mm, all right. A Raquel Beatriz, parece que me parecía ahí. Veamos. Yes, ahí está. Raquel Beatriz. Who was favorite teacher? Mm. Uh, my, favorite, my favorite teacher is uh, was. in the English uh, because I like it. Okay, excellent. Her favorite teacher was an English teacher. Okay, perfect. I don't know if you want to ask any question. No sé si quiere hacer una pregunta, Raquel. Mm. Uh, Kenya, what do you like best? What did you like best? Mm -hmm. sí. <laughs> okay. <laughs> excellent. Ah, sí es rico comer. Okay. Excellent, everybody. Thank you. Okay, so now no lo puedo hacer pequeño. Ah, ya hoy sí, ya pude. Okay, so now uh, today we're going to just talk. Yes. So now what we're going to do, the first day of classes. Okay, veamos, todos los que están calladitos. Vaya, Norma. Eh, what did you wear in the first time? Time of classes. First day of class. What did you wear? ¿Se recuerda la, con mis clases? Vaya, el primer día de clases. ¿Se recuerda? What did you wear? Where, where, where. Era para la parte del vestuario, algo así. Ajá. No recuerdo cómo andaba vestida, teacher. Yo que usted era el primer video, a ver cómo me veía. Ah, mentira. Sí. No, no me rinde en este momento el internet, teacher. Ah, ok. Mm. Camisa Excelente. blanca. Camisa blanca. Es la única que no me acuerdo. Va. Wow. Ok, so. Uh, veamos, alguien más. Ok. Thank you, Norma. Catherine okay. Giselle. Eh, were you early, late, or on time? ¿Usted es alguien que llega temprano, tarde, o a tiempo? A veces entraba muy temprano, pero a veces sí justo al tiempo. Ah, ok. Excelente. Eh, ¿Y en su primer día de clases estuvo temprano, tarde, o a tiempo? Temprano, a tiempo. That was on time. Do you remember about the different in time and on time? Yes. Okay, yes. tell me the difference between those. Una es cuando llega justo en el momento y otra es cuando llega unos minutos antes, algo así. ¿Cuál es cuál? On time es en tiempo. Okay. Y me un teléfono In time? Unos minutos antes. Ok. Excellent. Uh, perfect. Ok. Veamos. Alguien más de los que no participan. Veamos. Vázquez de León. Rosemary, you are here. Rosemary. Ajá. Uh -huh. Next question.
Velázquez o Vázquez, Velázquez de León. Um, where do you sit? No, we can use it, right? Because we're not in the classroom. How do you feel? Okay, Velázquez de León. How do you feel when you was in your first day of class? Mm, I, uh, I did feel... ¿Cómo se sintió? Emocionado. ¿Qué sintió? Say. Excited. I'm sorry? Okay. Exciting. Uh, exciting. Oh, okay. Good. Thank you. Okay, so now we're going to ask the other question too. Let me check. Oscar Salvador. Okay, so uh, who was the first person you met? Uh, in this case, we can use it, right? Because we're in the here. So, uh, okay, this one is very interesting. Uh, what did the teacher talk about the first day? Do you remember that? Mm. Una consulta, teacher. En Ando. este caso, sería algo así como que el primer tema que usted tocó. Ajá, ¿qué es lo que estuve bien diciendo? Este... WH eh, verbs. Ah, questions in the case. Permítanme un segundo, por favor. Ok. Ok. Ajá, WH question. Uh, do you think that... That was the first topic that we were discussing. Numbers. Ah, okay. We were discussing about the numbers, the dates, and the month of the year. Yes. Okay. okay. That was the first topic that we were discussing. Yay. Okay. Ni yo me recordaba, así que no se preocupe. Aquí tengo el libro. Okay. So, um, veamos. Esta es para todos. Who talked the most? And also the least. ¿Quién habló durante? ¿Quién habló más durante todo este curso, este módulo? ¿Y quién habló teacher. menos? Sorry. Teacher. Teacher. Jorge, hey, yo. Jorge. Jorge habló más. Jorge. Carla. Jorge. 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 Yeah. Teacher Karen Villacorta. No. Solo la teacher habló durante todo el módulo. Ustedes no. Ah? No. Yes. Habló la mayor a... parte. Habló, habló bastante Jorge Alexis y Rosenberg o Rosenberg, ¿no? ¿cómo se llama? Rosenberg. Y Carla Maricela. Ah, ok. No. no. Yo poquito hablé. Poquito. También Marito. Marito. ¿Y quién habló menos? <risa> eh, Kenia Yamilet. Kenia Yamilet. ¿Sí? No. Ahí sí está saliendo a luz todo. A la Carla. ¿Quién más cree que hablaron menos? Norma. Stephanie Lisset, teacher. Yo nunca la oía ahí. Stephanie Lisset. ¿Cómo no? Así habló bastante. Ok. Um, no remember. Les voy a hacer esta pregunta. The last one. How was your English, your English then? Regular. 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 ¿Cómo estuvo antes en su primer día de clases y cómo creen que están ahora? Ajá. ¿Creen que mejoraron un poquito? Yes. I am better. Yes. Yes. Do you think Aprendimos that? Aprendimos muchas cosas. Ok. 
Good to hear that. Glad to hear that. Y si no, pues uh, todavía vamos a tener acceso a la plataforma. Y practiquen y recuerden que si ustedes necesitan ayuda de algún tema, escriban. Ok. So, good. Ok, after that, we're going to pass with this activity about Ricky Martin. Yes, that we're going to read some information about him. Yes. Ok, just give me a moment. Veamos. Ok. So, mm -hmm. Mario y habló de Rodolfo. So you are going to read about this. You are going to read the first paragraph that from Ricky Martin to singing. And then another person that is going to continue with the next paragraph and so on. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six volunteers. Rodolfo Lopez going to start with that and then another one. Okay. Let me see. Ricky Martin was born in San Juan, Puerto Rico, on December 24, 1971. He was always a performer as a child. He appeared in, in television commercials and studies singing. Okay, good. Continue. Uh, Ro Rosember. 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 Hmm. <laughs> no se va a agradar la ticha. No. <laughs> Soy la única que voy a quedar. Yes, ticha. Hay que tener fe. <laughs> okay, continue. Rosember. Ah, sí me salió. Va. Como no lo pronuncio bien, no está. Ok, Jesús, Antonio, continue. Sí, aquí estoy, lo que pasa es que no me ve. Ah, con razón. Ah, pues después va Jesús. Después de Rosember, va Jesús. Yes. ¿De dónde empiezo? Aquí, at the age. At the age. Ok. Eight. At the age of um, 12, uh, he joined the Latin Boy Van Menudo. He worked hard with them and he become very well now but he left the ground after yeah. five years okay excellent continue jesus martin moved to new york city but he didn't work for a year he was very frustrated so he moved to Mexico City and got a part on a Mexican soap opera. Soon afterward, he recorded two Spanish language albums. After this success, he moved back to the USA. Oh, next, uh, Jorge, Alexis. Uh, back in the USA, He happened on an American soap opera and, and in the Bulgar show. Less miserable than he made his first English language album. Okay. Catherine Lopez, continue. That album was called Carl Ricky Martin, his biggest hit 
living la vida loca was on that album okay thank you carla paola Juan Carlos Menéndez. Continue. ¿Dónde voy a leer? Now. Ah, ahorita. Eh, now, eh, now, he's famous around the world, eh, but his style works hard, and his style loves singing. Uh, has decided to our reporter for the newspaper USA today. I want to do forever. Oh, good. Excellent. Thank you, everybody, for your participation. So now what we're going to do, uh, we're going to do is that we're going to answer uh, this question or do some question about uh, what we were reading. Yes. So read the article, then write a question for each answer. So uh, how we're going to worry, uh, read, uh, write, sorry, the first uh, question in Puerto Rico, okay? ¿Cómo sería la where, primera pregunta? Where was he born? Okay, good. Um, next question, what do you think? Mm -hmm. When was he moved to Mexico? Okay, no. the number two is at the age of 12. Uh huh, what do you think? Can I start the thing? Okay, can be when he, okay, good. Uh, next, what do you think about after five years? Uh-huh. <clears throat> what do you think? He left. Okay, he is over here. He left the group after five years. Yes. Uh huh. And the answer is after five years. And what do you think the question is going to be? Uh -huh. Okay, we're going to have a uh, two minutes to do this activity. Okay, about after five years because he was frustrated, less miserable, and living la vida loca. Okay, so we're going to write the question about those answers. So we have the Four minutes, four minutes for this activity. Okay. No entendí que teníamos que hacer, teacher. Preguntas con respecto este, a esa respuesta. A estas respuestas. Y aquí está el artículo si lo necesitan. Yo para las preguntas no soy muy buena, teacher. No, no sé cómo redactarlas, por eso no hice la tarea. Ok, ¿quién la hizo? Ajá, ajá. ¿Quién hizo esta tarea? ¿Nadie? No. Ok, veamos. Uh, the first one, ¿cómo me dijeron la primera? 
Where was he born? Okay. Good. Excellent. Okay. Number two, what do you think? La puede, la puede escribir ahí para ver cómo se escribe. Okay. Where was... Uy. Where was he? Uh -huh. Where was he? Born. Born. Okay. Where was he born? Alcanzan a verle esta letrita. Sí. Sí. Okay. Good. Okay. Jesús, do you have the number two? No teacher. Okay, what do you think? Uh huh. And the article says. The article says, at the age of twelve, he joined the Latin boy band. Okay, what do you think? Alguna idea cómo la pudiéramos hacer? Oh, when he start the Okay, puede ser when he start his career or how oh. uh -huh. oh, when did Aquí tenemos otra. When he when did he he get get in of the boy band when did he get in of the boy band can be or no what do you think Okay, number three. Uh, another idea how we're going to write the question. Uh huh. After five years. Mm, okay, ahora comprendo. Esta. No, no era esta. Esta que me escribieron acá. Get out. Yes. Okay. Esta podría ser acá. También. Yes. When did he get out? Sería out. When he get out of the one boy band after five years. Okay. Después les damos otra lógica. Okay, so number four, what do you think? Why? Uh -huh, why? Por qué? Did why? Why? Uh -huh. Did he? Be frustrated. He frustrated. Okay. He. Uy. Frustrate. Okay, veamos. Tenemos otro mensaje. Ah, cabal. Puede ser también. Thank you, Raquel. Uy. Okay. Why, why he, or why did he frustrated? Like this, what do you think? Podemos poner esta que me acaban de escribir. Mm, aquí, yes. No. When 
When did he? Number five, what do you think? Uh, veamos. Catherine, thank you. Veamos. Uh, can be. Uy. Uy, borré esta. Pero voy a poner esta. Why did Ricky Martin move to Mexico? Okay. Can be. Yes, number five, what do you think? Let's be suitable. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the number five? The number five, it says it's over here. Back in the USA, he appeared on an American soap opera and in the Broadway show. That's miserable. Uh -huh. What do you think? ¿Cómo creen ustedes que podríamos hacer esa pregunta? Uh -huh. What? was the name of the uh -huh. what do you think that is going to be good do you think that is good or not yes No? Teacher? Yes? Mande. Yeah. And the last one, where you think? How do you think? Veamos, aquí me acaban de mandar algo. Veamos, what was his I get successful? Can be right? Yes or no? What do you think? Oh, what was his first hit? Which was the first presentation of Ricky Martin? Ah, okay, can be that one right here. Instead of the name of the soap opera. Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Okay, so almost like this, there was the question that we should or should or did do for these answers, okay? So we have to think about what can write, okay? A little bit easy. Yeah, I know, it's a little bit hard, okay? So now, after that, uh, we have the last number, this event in Ricky Marty's life from the first event to the last event. So we have here, number, um, Eight. Let me check. Okay, so what do you think that about non, the letter eight? Los eventos que vamos a hacer los vamos a enumerar. Sí, nosotros ya tenemos el primer ejemplo, que es el primero, que es la letra G, que es he was born. Yes. ¿Cuál creen ustedes que es el número dos?
Uh -huh. H. The number H. Okay. H. Okay. Okay, number two. What do you think about the number three? Uh -huh. What do you Teacher. think? Yes. El número dos no sería he is to the same. Sí. sí, sería I. El I. Porque, uh -huh. Porque según la lectura dice que he upper, upper Here. in television, commercial and study thing. Okay, so that is the number two. Okay, so I is number two. Thank you. Okay, number three, what do you think? Okay, number this three. H. H. I. This one or E? This is number three? Okay, number four. You move it to Mexico? Move it to Mexico. Okay, letter A. Yay. Okay, everybody. Creo que esto este, lo vamos a tener que hacer en, en sus casitas y me los mandan, ¿verdad? Para que puedan leer bien el párrafo y lo puedan hacer. Okay. Este, pero me lo mandan, ¿ok? Voy a leer ahí y me los mandan uh, ahora en la noche, si quieren. Y yo mando las respuestas que ustedes me manden, ¿ok? Ok, so before we end the class, uh, today is the last class. Um, ok, so I will pass the last time about the attendance. So see you soon, see you around. Thank you everybody for, for being on time, for everything, passion, uh for everything thank you everybody thank you so much i love to be here with you this time and i hope that you're going we're going to be together and then another time right so thank you thank you thank you teacher i have a question teacher yes tell me yeah so acerca de los diplomas que puedo ir en esta semana Uh, ya que no pude ir la semana pasada. El, sí, esta semana creo que sí pueden ir. Ya no sé si es la última semana. Escriba en el grupo general, por favor, que ahí nos no. pueden dar mejor este, referencias con respecto a eso. ¿verdad? Yo les puedo decir que sí y no sé. Como yo no paso en las oficinas. Ok, voy a pasar lista la última vez. Adriana Guadalupe. Here, teacher. Thank you. Eh, um, Jocelyn, no, Jesús Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jocelyn Graciela. Jorge Alexis. Present teacher. Thank you. José Ismael. José Ismael. Ok. Eh, Jocelyn Madaí. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Juan Carlos Menéndez. Thank you. Juan Fernando. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Maricela. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Carla Paola. I'm here. Thank you. Catherine Abigail. Present. Thank you. Catherine Giselle. I'm here. Thank you. Eh, Kenia Jamilet. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Kenny Jamilet. 
I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Livorio Adiel. Lorena Yamilet. Here. Thank you. Mario Adolfo. Present, teacher. Thank you. Maybelline Dariana. Present. <laughs> Eh, oh, Miguel señor. Alexander. <laughs> Miguel Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Miguel Ángel. Present. Thank you. Natalia Inés. Present. Thank you. Nelson Javier. Present. Thank you. Norma Enríquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Oscar Salvador. Present teacher. Thank you. Raquel Beatriz. Present. Thank you, Rodolfo Lopez. Present teacher, and thank you. Thank you very much. So we are going to celebrate the end of the course. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Okay. Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Ay, no me gradué. No me gradué. No me gradué. Okay, Rosenberg. Rosemary. Va a repetir el curso. Sí, voy a repetir. Present teacher. Thank you, Roxana Melissa. Present teacher. Thank you. And uh, Stephanie Lisset. Present. Okay, everybody. Okay, so uh, see you soon. See you around. Gracias por todo. Gracias por su paciencia. Así que nos seguimos viendo. Así que sigan estudiando. Gracias a usted, teacher, Gracias. por compartirnos su conocimiento. Okay, everybody. Good to see you. Good to know you. And goodbye. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Take care. Gracias por todo. De nada. Cuídense. Thank you. Bye bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.